Okay, listen up. <clears throat> I am going to weigh my in uh, on a new Donald Trump's Hello, watch. Hello, everyone. It's your favorite president, Donald J. Trump, here to introduce something really special. I think you're going to love it. My new Trump watches. We're doing quite a number with watches. And the quality to me is very important. Oh, the God. Trump Victory Turbion. This isn't just any watch. It's one of the best watches made. It's a Turbion watch with almost 200 grams of gold and more than 100 real diamonds. The gold looks fake. That's a lot of diamonds. I love gold. I love diamonds. We all do. <laughs> Only 147 of these extraordinary watches will ever exist in the world. I love and diamonds. Owning one puts you in a very exclusive club. I have watch number one, and I'm going to keep it. Uh, listen up. <clears throat> uh, the gentleman that you have heard... He gave accent on fake gold and he stated, I love diamonds. Uh, I'm going to do MK Ultra on this watch. This is for the, for the Central Intelligence Agency and for the Federal Bureau Investigation, who, if will not enforce this case, I will want to know why for every individual involved in it. It's a report. It's not, it's not a complain it's not a brag it's not a cry or anything like this this is a report this is a police police report is what this is so i decided i'm going to do this he did embarrass zelensky who came from ukraine during a really critical moments for ukraine the united states uh, with some really stupid shit in Donald Trump got all the attention uh, he ever wanted or asked for in respect to MK Ultra pertaining to his new watch collection. I do not know where this is. Here, let me check this. This is obviously Donald Trump's website. I don't browse their websites. I don't go there. Um, I did, I did browse the website of only, um, one Royal, uh, and that's of the city of Anavari. That's from Thailand, uh, a girl from Thailand. That's all I did, but she's talented. She's talented. Um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do, um, stuff that you see here I'm gonna do for you I'm gonna give you a testimony about the watch how the watch according to Donald Trump and this is the way it was during MK Ultra first thing what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give you some idea about uh, how MK Ultra worked um, precisely basically the technology of watch industry involved in mk ultra in in this case in this mk ultra craze everybody was involved from swiss makers rolex japanese casio seiko you name it including japanese royals to uh entire chinese watch manufacturing industry everybody was involved in it everybody uh, it was Bill Clinton who explained to me that Timex, in fact, is Casio. Uh, I liked Casio brand. And what happened was um, Bill Clinton insisted me on buying Timex. And he couldn't get me by past uh, Casio. And it became evident that Timex is actually Casio, all the engines, movements, mechanisms inside of the Timex are those of Casio. Um, it's, it's a simple thing. This is how it works. During MK Ultra, uh, that's how they operated. First thing what they did was they wanted to determine from the catalog of the watches 
what kind of watches do I like? You know, is it this, is it that? Then they wanted to learn about what do you like on the watch? Just like every one of you, just like every one of us does. They wanted to know what exactly appeals to you on the watch. Uh, what and even if you don't like the watch, what is it exactly that appeals to you on the watch, right? And so the way this operates, I'm going to use a Donald Trump's case because this against this is a police report against Donald Trump. Donald Trump did to me this. Oh, so uh, this became like a permanent problem, obviously. I don't get this. This is what the problem was. I didn't do it. Here. Um, this is a watch. It's a funny, actually, this is kind of an entertaining, funny video. And to this thing here, obviously, Donald Trump referred to as a tourbillon. Um, I don't know about anything about the tourbillon. Um, this is a $10 watch. I purchased for 10 bucks. Sometimes in... I don't know, but it was hard, and I had to buy myself something to... To keep the spirits alive basically from collapsing myself into a total oblivion I don't know when this was this watch was purchased I purchased this watch I don't know I have no clue honestly probably sometimes in during the psychiatric hospitalization maybe 2013 or something like that something like ten dollars it was it was really cheap and so I decided, guess what, I would buy myself something like this, something different, something to put my spirits up. Uh, make no mistake, they stopped making this watch. The entire Chinese manufacturing industry started to study this case. The British Royal studied this. They love watches. Um, this is nothing special. This is just... This is just a basic watch, but it is somewhat more visible, you know, than other watches that were online for the same cost. Usually what you have is just a skeleton, a bloody skeleton. Uh, it looks shitty, if you ask me. I don't like this uh, style, the way they offer This is basically goes into the category of the skeleton watches, skeleton, skeleton automatic. This is a poor watch, if you ask me. This is a funky watch. This is just here and there sometimes you want to put on a hand and go out there and maybe have fun, something to put in your hands. To make yourself feel, I don't know, different, whatever. Uh, this is something like this, you know, uh, or whatever. These are zlotis, these are not dollars. This is a zloty. I don't even know. Five zloty for one dollar or something like that. I don't know what the exchange is. It's not much money. Um... This is maybe thirty thirty dollars, uh, which is astronomically a lot of money. But this is this is basically this is the watch here, except that this is like I don't know, goldenized, um, you know, um, whatever it is. This is a watch that should go for about maybe, I don't know, 15, 20 bucks, maybe now. So the costs went up and you can get something uh, 
Um, actually, I don't. Um, they did some. They. Um, this is something like this. There you go. Here it is. It's now. Uh, it's not the same. It's. It's a winner. And. Um, Still is not the same. Uh, I think that this watch I have is prettier. Um, but this is this is the important watch. No, Donald Trump did not. Uh, this is not. This did not. This watch is important to say. Did not have absolutely any impact on Donald Trump. This was as close as I could possibly get to. Uh, a little time piece, something to entertain myself. Broke and basically left for that. I went to buy myself this watch, simple, this from eBay, whatever, uh, to make myself a day, you know, to make myself feel good about something. I wasn't spending money on anything for so many years. And so I bought this. And so. Donald Trump's story, however, is different. Donald Trump's story is like this, and it doesn't go to 2013. That's why I wanted to declare this. Donald Trump did have this watch on his wrist, literally. However, that's at least what he claimed. That's one thing. He did have a watch like this. Um, there is something else. It's important that I declare that this is not the watch that was used in a watchmaking process of Donald Trump. Yeah, uh, Donald Trump wanted to know uh, what is it exactly that I like about watch. And so they realized through the thorough interrogation that I like a clean face, uh, everything clean. Uh, it, it came clear that I also like the basil. That's why I, I did this watch here. That I also like the basil. So this is the part for those that do not know. Usually, in this case, I am sure it doesn't. And you need to be very careful with this stuff because uh, a lot of people purchase watch thinking that they are buying the watch with the basil. And it's really not. But... This thing here, this this thing, yes, this this should be moving back and forth, actually in one direction or wherever it is. You you should be having ability to turn this ring around the dial. This here, this is the dial here, right? This is a dial and this is a bezel. Uh, you should be you should have ability to turn this thing. Now I never was really motivated, interested in this stuff. It kind of looked big, chunky to me. Uh, but okay, this was all the time involved in MK Ultra, so why not? Uh, during MK Ultra, this was the main thing, this type of watch, the way you see with the bezel, uh, you know. And so, uh, Donald Trump, not only Donald Trump, but entire Chinese watch industry became based on. Now, this is very serious business. Chinese watch manufacturing industry learn from me about watches more than what they learn from absolutely anyone entire chinese watch industry looks when it comes to um this kind of watches let me demonstrate it this kind of watches like this uh because of me that's an insane statement as it gets the one will make like a suicidal statement now, this is a fact What's happening with this shit? Well, when I was younger, I did have appetite for um, for the watches. And so, it is one thing uh, I noticed. And Japanese were guilty for this because they planted watches in the city of the Novomest to make them extremely affordable, uh, even for the kids to wear. Um, I like this stuff here that you see moving. You see this stuff, the way it's moving? And um, we'll never forget when I would go to Austria, they had watches. I think they pulled them out of the shelves. Let me, as a matter of fact, see this. Oh, it's here. Yeah, 
Okay, this is the watch I do wear. This one here. This is another $2 watch, $3 watch. I highly recommend. It's not exactly exact, but it's working fine. Um, if you pay attention to this thing here, the way it's this this stuff is all the time performing something. Those Austrian watches were more imaginative. They had something like German, Swiss, whatever they had. They had like really uh, stuff that was moving back and forth while it would show the time and stuff. Uh, you're talking about 80s, 90s. Uh, something that spooked entire American you know, billionaire industry. They all rushed to the to me in this house during MKL train. They wanted to know where the fuck have you seen this kind of watch? Where have you seen this and that? I've seen it. I didn't dream. And even if I would dream, you got to admit, that's a pretty fucking good uh, dreamer, man. Uh, the thing is, you can't see this watch is absolutely anywhere on the internet. There is something else that happened. You know, the truth is that watch manufacturing industry was extremely developed in Switzerland and in Germany at the time. Uh, it was so developed, in fact, that I could swear on Swiss and German watch uh, opposed to Japanese watch. Seriously. Um, and that's hard to imagine because Casio and Seiko, that's just wow. Uh, and I don't know, the same thing was with the cars. Mercedes, BMW, Audi, etc., etc., etc. Um, Germans might have, Swiss might have deliberately pulled out of the shelves the technologies, the watch technologies, and would not disclose this anymore. You couldn't see, you couldn't see these watches. For the fuck of it. Talking about a Schwarzenegger traveling to Austria with a Stallone. Uh, they got into the watch business too. Uh, looking for this watch is like crazy. Where, they, where have you seen one? Delivered me, you know, to the city where Aunt is in Austria, right across the border. Show us the store with this, that. They fucking interrogated the entire city filler about these watches. And then I was guilty. <laughs> they said, you lied us. You pulled it for the nose. This kind of watches exist nowhere. You made this shit up. No, the thing is, I did not made it up. <laughs> I did not made it up. Another manufacturer who did the crazy shit, it was really incredible, was a citizen. That was another player. I love this Japanese Seiko citizen. <laughs> and the thing is that they started to do this kind of uh, technology known as <laughs> Ana, Ana Digi. Uh, that's like analog digital technology and the watches are not that big they were they were smaller like not those like I have which I like it anyways I'm not fucking giving those I like them um, I like it I like those I like every one of them I, I purchased they're good everyone serves its purpose I don't regret them the thing is they are damaged they are not new this is not what I paid for uh, obviously uh, for reasons I'm about to discuss in this video, it does pertain also to Donald Trump. And so the Japanese, actually Japanese, the Chinese learn about certain things. Uh, you know, I bought the Casio, you know, the small watch, like W91, like this model here. Uh, this is not Casio, you know, th this is a Chinese cheaper version of it, which is nice. It's, it's, it's very nice. It will save you a lot of money. I don't know. This is one euro. Wow, that's cheap. Um, so they learned about they learned about uh, this is a welcome deal. Welcome deal means that you're gonna have to pay another four euros, five euros in addition to it. This is only for the people who open new accounts. So be careful with this stuff. Um, I didn't consider any of this stuff. But there is a problem with this watch. The problem with this watch is that if you look at if you look at the watch, when you look the watch from up close, it's got a serious fault. This watch, the problem with this watch, and why I did not like ever one, is because this here, this stuff here, 
it's too close to the edge here this and consequently it's a shadow uh, that makes visibility poor this kind of stuff visibility on general was poor this is this I rated this like a shitty watch I bought one Casio is Casio quality is quality is Casio that's the name uh, but still not good when compared to the watch I have on my wrist this is probably the best digital watch I ever had this one here what I love about this watch do you see how I turn one if you did without with the other one you would you would be missing you wouldn't see shit those on the watch that I demonstrated the numbers are small if you turn one like this you should barely see anything on this one here what I like about Chinese learned about and started to manufacture they tested it on people my ideas and it have proven that my ideas about the perception of the watch were just magnificent I mean if you started to follow up these ideas I didn't do I mean the thing is that these are engineers that really know how to do the magic I mean this is a science it takes a science to do the stuff like this I didn't do shit you only did the stuff according to my perception of what I liked and it have proven that with the people who protested my ideas that these ideas are actually working that it's fine everybody likes to have clearly like a big LCD where the numbers are not close to the edge but the numbers are away from the edge with a little bit bigger number numbers nicely selected with where it says the day and date and so on people just we all like that uh, this thing that is moving in that corner I am not too crazy about uh, I do love it though since it's there it's there uh, I would pay the same price even if it wouldn't be there uh, I think this watch is just simply excellent uh, and then the, the Chinese went beyond something that I never suggested is they actually went ahead and they they even developed the ability to change the colors on the watch which is insane I mean you know literally change the colors on the watch I mean uh, or make one uh, when you press the light or make one uh, you know whatever trip whatever so wow uh, but the thing is that this 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 things to make the the digital display further away from the edge uh, to make the digital display uh, therefore visible nicely calm you, you know, calms you nicely those kind of ideas were really literally 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 were mine since the beginning of the time when this shit started that's how they would do the stuff what is it that you like on the watch and what is it that you don't like on the watch now we even got into the business with the watches I never even owned such as those of Donald Trump this here what Donald Trump explained to me is a tourbillon you know with this thing here um, Donald Trump too was the one who was taking notes diligently at this table here uh, he would be always whenever he would come he would have some watch and he would be asking about some watch specimen and he would be asking oh, which parts I like what do I like about certain watch and this and that now he became obsessed with this idea and yeah it became clear that I don't like the stuff that I demonstrated you on my watch um, too much of this skeleton visible unless everything will be moving of course but the thing is it, it's not moving that stuff is not moving so the most the best for me probably would be well if this watch would have a day and date nicely displayed like a classic watch this would be a perfect watch but it doesn't have one um, this is just a watch that's all there is to it and the only thing that's moving here in this in this watch is this thing here now also because it's automatic you can see also um, a higher Hertz a higher bit uh, of the uh, third hand the second uh, pointer second pointer which is not doing you know click 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 
but it's just going uh, smooth. I like, those are the features I liked. I never had any of this, and so I said, well, why not? Let's do it. Um, so Donald Trump came to conclusion, not because of this watch, but literally on my case, through interrogation, MKUltra interrogation, that the best thing is to have the whole thing closed. A clean face, nice face with exactly the type of watch that he, he created. Uh, and with the part which is open, like a skeleton, uh, known as a tourbillon, basically moving inside. Therefore, this piece. And there you have it. Donald Trump, his watch appeared over there. Um, when did this Donald Trump watch appear for the first time? So this is just the explanation how Donald Trump assembled the watch. I was in the center of this. Yes, fuck I was. That is true. Uh, now about the timing of the watch, how the wa the, how this watch came to life. But Donald Trump was playing with the watches already. I think he made a first deal, not even as I suggested in 98. Uh, I think the Donald Trump first deal with the Chinese was in 1996. This was like, like some kind of a mega deal that he did with the Chinese that he was extremely pleased about. Uh, for God knows under what firm this stuff went. Uh, but this is what he was doing, this kind of stuff. And this was extremely, extremely lucrative. Uh, he all the time bragged about how good that stuff was and this and that and uh, la, 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 la. Um, <clears throat> the watch that you are talking about, this gentleman here, did you see? Hello, everyone. It's your favorite. That's why I also placed him on here. I placed him on here. I placed him here for two reasons. Uh, I placed him here because... He made two statements, not only because he reviewed the watch, but he made two statements. He stated that gold is fake, and he was laughing about the diamonds. Um, well, um, this gentleman we're going to learn, we're going to find out about, could be a Donald Trump's trickster. Uh, this gentleman was once a supporter of Donald Trump. A, uh, this is MKUltra, and... The trickery in MK Ultra, uh, it's unimaginable, it's limitless, is what I'm trying to say. And so, when you have a cat like myself, you're not going to get me on it. Uh, in fact, you are in it. He was a supporter of Donald Trump until 2013, 2014. Uh, he got a watch. And I was severely, most severely brainwashed uh, by Donald Trump sometimes in 2000 and 2011. Uh, I don't know how much do you guys believe. Uh, sorry, remember, fake the amondes. Fake diamonds. You know where the fake diamonds? Fake diamonds appeared on the market. Uh, and this fake diamonds, not in 2011, they appeared already before, but there is something else to it. Uh, they started to fuck with the diamonds that will become virtually impossible to rule uh, whether they're real or fake. Do you understand me, what I'm saying? Uh, the fake diamonds, it's got a long uh, history. But now you're talking about the artificially manufactured fake diamonds. I am not going to go into... This is what they started to brainwash me with. This is what they started to brainwash me with. I'm talking about the Donald Trump. You're talking about the year 2011 before I was thrown into the psychiatric hospital in 2012. This is a really, really a piece of work, this Donald Trump. 
This is a real, real piece of work. He started to brain massage me together with the Milan coach, and that was really, really interesting. Together with the Milan Kuchan, with the nurse Janko, with the psychiatrist Kapsch, with Slovenian police, with the whole team of these criminals here from Novo Mesto, about a coming watch, about how much money he made, how good he was the business with the Chinese, and this and that, and back and forth, and started to brain massage me about arrival of the watch that is going to make him even more profit now in 2011 and that would be the watch that would be with the fake diamonds you see that's why i'm really careful with this you 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 hear this hello everyone it's your favorite president donald j trump here to introduce something really special i think you're gonna love it my new Trump watches. I'm doing quite a number with watches. <laughs> I'm not laughing. That's oh the gentleman laughing. Turbion. This isn't just any watch. It's one of the best watches made. It's a Turbion watch with almost 200 grams of gold and more than 100 real diamonds. The gold looks fake. It's a lot of diamonds. I love gold. I love diamonds. We all do. <laughs> Only 147 of these extraordinary watches will ever exist in the world. I love diamonds. Only one puts you in a very exclusive club. I. You see, the thing is that <clears throat> every political MK Ultra diarrhea, Donald Trump, and not only Donald Trump, but also Barack Obama and Kamala Harris and every fucking one of you played was always a chain, a set of players in it. It will always, classic, always start with something that you see here and it would always, always develop into entire story. In, uh, as an MK Ultra victim, really do not judge book by the cover because you're going to get so fucked uh this what you have heard right there on me personally if i would know one plus one uh it would have fucked me up uh, based on a brainwash that i would not even know right from wrong when it comes three minus two literally um it started with a shit like this it started with a shit like this it did but i have to tell you something including this man here after the first review he made during mk ultra uh it was everything was fucked up everything was fucked up it was milan kuchan with a nurse Yanko, with a psychiatrist Peter Kopsch, with an armament of police investigators, with a Chinese manufacturers. Oh, in China, you get really appreciated for, you know, for being used. I mean, call it a communist way, call it whatever fucking way, but, you know, this is the way it was. Uh, insisting me to tell the world, to reveal the world, yeah, because Donald Trump was certain during MKUltra, we're going to get to this part, this is why this is for Central Intelligence Agency, for the Federal Bureau Investigation, it's a police report, for the police, that I will do a watch report on this, on his watch collection, based on sickness, mental illness, based on having the watches destroyed, delivered, destroyed, is you can become really visible, not only for Vladimir Putin, but it became evident that Donald Trump believed he's going to get a video which is going to grant one something like, you know, that he's going to self-vindicate himself from the prosecution for the crimes he committed against me. It became evident that Donald Trump was going to use me, literally, the brainwash he had done on me, to get the statements from me, 
which would rather cause me harm and prove me wrong, etc., etc. It became evident also that after the first year review, it became evident that this guy did uh, that, in fact, that from other people also that were involved, because it was not only this guy, it was the whole set of other people also, British and American people that already reviewed the watch that Donald Trump is going to manufacture in the future. It became evident the watch is not so bad. That watch was not all that shit, as people would start to claim it's a shit. Even the watch, in my opinion, personally, watch is shit, and watch is not a good choice. In my, I would not do the watch like this. I, if I would do design, uh, the watch Donald Trump designed is... The watch, any one of you can do it yourself. I mean, you can do it yourself for less than, I don't know. I don't know how much is a two billion on watch, but, you know. I'm not going to get into it. This, this doesn't have anything to do with it. But it's other official figures in dollars. I'm going to give you what Donald Trump actually even paid for this watch. Um, however, he's not going to get statement from me that these are not real diamonds, despite the way the video started uh, with a gentleman laughing about it, uh, suggesting it's a fake gold, etc., etc., etc. I don't think it's a fake gold. Donald Trump stated it's 215 grams of gold. Uh, Donald Trump had a discussion with me about gold. Um, well, a gram is uh, 76 euros here in, uh, obviously, Europe. Uh, that amounts to $16,340, this stuff here. Uh, if the watch has 215 grams, we get to 16,340 euros worth of gold on, in that watch. Now, we're talking about the diamonds for which Donald Trump alone afterwards even stated me are not going to be real and it's something i told him in the face during an culture then you are a charlatan then you're a fucking cheater if you're gonna do this and it's gonna be the diamonds and stuff like this then you're a liar you're a cheater uh and he started to cry to me that i don't know how much it costs and uh you know, all kinds of stuff and, uh, you know, blah, 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 blah. You know, simple as this, you know. Um, I am not saying that diamonds aren't real. I'm not saying that diamonds aren't real. I am not going to go and fuck myself and do the stuff. That's not what you're going to get from me. Uh, the initial cost for this watch that was given to Donald Trump in year 2009... Uh, maybe even 2008, the initial cost of manufacturing for this watch, talking about the manufacturing process, uh, that was given, was given to Donald Trump at price of 2,500 American dollars. Don, uh, talking about the Chinese here, he got this estimate from Chinese, even 1,650, stuff like this, then Donald Trump continued to negotiate, negotiate, negotiate. Uh, and the price jumped all the way to uh, 3,000, uh, 500, uh, 4,000, 3,500, 4,000 dollars. And the final deal, based on what Donald Trump have stated to me, Ranged about seven thousand to seven thousand five hundred American dollars. Um, now let's talk about who did this. Who did this manufacturing of this watch? Well, initially this stuff was meant for uh, Chinese to do the work, and the way they were gonna fuck me 
in 2011 uh, with the diamonds, with making for what they demanded would be a statement that the, the diamonds are not, aren't real. Uh, the way they were going to fuck me is uh, claiming me that it was the Chinese side that supplied them with information about how the watch is going to uh, look like and how the watch is going to be made and how the watch is going to be blah, 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 blah. Yeah, you understand me? It makes no fucking sense because Donald Trump alone, years after, talking about the 2017, 2016, absolutely insisted me, demonstrating me watch, driving me around, not only, not, did not keep me also only in his home, but was driving me around, wherever the fuck he was driving me around, literally with, uh, he put me a watch on my hand? He did. Did he allow me to have a watch on my hand? No. He was showing me those watches and guaranteeing me that he's going to get, that he, one of the watches is mine and was showing me these watches. And we had this conversation big time. I would never miss out on the red watch he made because it didn't make me any fucking sense. Um, the color red he had chosen for the watch is really nice. Uh, but I think that with the base on everything is the whole thing is too fucking simple. It's simplistic. It's simple. It looks like his golden Snickers. I think it's a serious lack of design. I, I think it's it's but you know, there's people of course that like that. So, you know, this is just my taste. It's really, really simplistic, but I really, really like sophisticated. I like to go deeper and I like to find a, you know, a perfect solution to whatever the fuck I do. But anyhow, just let's leave this stuff alone. Um, this is the way he liked it. All right. And I'm not saying anything. People have different tastes. And I'm not going to go against people's tastes. I don't even go against his taste. Uh, let him be. Why not? If those are his ideas, that's how he wanted. He invested a fair amount of time in it. Uh, it's not the worst watch piece i've seen it uh but you know this is basically this this is how he did and uh you know i had no idea uh one thing i don't absolutely see myself in it is when he was demonstrating me uh the back of the watch think big uh when he was demonstrated me this back of the watch which says think big uh I am being humorous here. Uh, I, I I think I would go and, and 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 strangle him right there. I'm just joking. But what the fuck? I mean, you know what I mean? Uh, you're taking one fucking minute of my time and you're showing me this shit. And I was not worth it. And it applies the same to this British royals and everyone else. I wasn't worth the fucking watch. I mean, hey, if... I was an MK Ultra, and I would do stuff like this. I would put the kid watch in his pocket. He would wake up at home with a watch in his pocket, literally. Do you understand me? What the fuck I'm saying? It doesn't matter. It's different people. It's different stuff. Some people's time is precious, is valuable. Others people, time spent on a torture is not worth shit. Obviously, it was money in his pocket so let's just leave this shit alone i would not forget the watch i would not forget his driving around showing me his watch is showing off also at his home in the united states of america no need to blame the chinese fucked him or anything like this with this issue here because they did not the thing is donald trump if this aren't real diamonds donald trump was the one who wanted to fuck me to make a statement like this because it was programmed like i suggested earlier every one of these stories they're all designed to come out as a story with yeah making initial statement like this donald j trump here to introduce something really special i think you're gonna love it my new trump watches we're doing quite a number with watches the quality to me is very important Oh, Trump God. Victory Turbion. This, this isn't just, just any watch. watch. It's, it's one of the best, best watches made. 
It's a turbulent watch with almost 200 grams of gold and more than 100 real diamonds. The gold looks fake. Yeah, it does look fake. But, sir, you told me also in continuation, because you had me inside of your studio, you had me next to you, all that stuff. You also told me in continuation that your statement at the beginning of the video, which is really misleading, uh, pertains to this type of watch. You know what I mean? It doesn't pertain to the other watch, but it pertains to this kind of watch. So, uh, yeah, obviously that for 700, the gold is not going to be real. It's expensive. Uh, but then again, you have assholes that charge even more money for the shittier watches than what you see right there. These watches don't actually even look bad. These are good looking, fairly good looking watches. And if you were to out go out there and buy, I don't know, what kind of watch from some who knows who, you might have ended up even paying, I don't know, more money for some Gucci or something. I don't know. I'm not a lover of any of that. I don't know. I don't follow that. I don't, I don't follow any of that stuff. You know what I mean? Just because it's a brand, whatever brand, and uh, they do this stuff in, in a watch business. Now, would I recommend this to you? Um, I am not going to say anything. I, I I guarantee you that the watches you see right there, you can get it done for probably $100. Nice little plated gold with a plated case. Uh, but let's make it 150 with a really good case with, you know, with the parts that you assemble together with, with the pointers, hands. Um, and uh, yeah, in, in AliExpress, they're going to even make you... Uh, whatever you know if you, if, if you prefer other than trump or you prefer other than whatever is written below they're gonna they're gonna custom made you uh you know assign uh, whatever plated uh, gold plated whatever silver plated uh design that you're gonna afterwards embed on, on your watch you know so i don't know what's worth because the word is in eye of beholder <laughs> you know think big for me did not work out that's disgusting that is fucking disgusting i hope it became clear under what kind of circumstances i was uh saying somebody i hear think big is like like a tremendous slap in the face uh that's like so fucking insultive so disgusting donald trump loves to use that word disgusting and that's really disgusting but it's like total disdain basically for you gotta ask yourself donald what kind of values do you actually represent i mean what what the fuck what kind of values are you about i mean i think personally that those that uh, support you definitely are not clear about your values because your values uh, your values to your supporters to your voters equal those of a really really expensive lawyers uh, that are in it basically to suck the money from those that inquire about their help and eventually due to dried up saving accounts leave them even without a lawyer maybe on a half halfway you know what I mean uh, this shit is happening in this I think this is you sir I think that you are uh, Barel Sin Pondo like they say in Spanish Barrel sin fondo, that means uh, a barrel without a bottom. I think that people pour money in it and the money goes to infinity into fucking nowhere. This is you, sir. This is your presidency. This is what you are. I was told by Bush, I was told by Clinton, they definitely going to buy this watch. Uh, there was stuff like this during MK Ultra. They did commercial. They did some schizophrenia shit for other people who got the audios afterwards. But I wouldn't give a shit about any of these watches if you ask me. First of all, you gotta appreciate yourself. I mean, and then again, if you really appreciate this kind of stuff and you have too much money, uh, then probably this is uh, the stuff for you. But if you do happen to have a watch like this on your wrist, uh, I will not talk to you. That's one thing I'm gonna say to you. If you do happen to find to have a watch like this on your wrist. Um, for me personally, this is just totally tasteless and perverted stuff.
I have a big bag of watches that have been destroyed uh, for this criminal to play some kind of a sick game. Watch game, a sick game, through which he literally guided me. Uh, anyhow, uh, if this is true, the cost for the watch would amount to probably about 25,000, uh, maybe even dollars. 26, maximum maybe 27,000 dollars. And uh, on a halfway of negotiations with the Chinese, which started in, eventually even in 2006, he started to smell about how much would be this watch. Uh, in 2008, he started to negotiate. Uh, in 2015, however, it was concluded that it, in fact, would be a Swiss company that would do a job for Donald Trump. Um, if you paid attention to this watch, I know all about watches, and uh, let me do a little review. I don't have one of these in hand, of course, but uh, I know all about watches, and uh, let me do a little review. Uh, if you notice, and I don't have to copy paste this stuff, it says on the bottom, it says Swiss made, Swiss made. But Donald Trump absolutely wanted me to, to state that the watch is Chinese made. I don't have the proof that the watch is not Chinese made. Uh, but on a halfway of negotiations, I found myself in a company very familiar to me somewhere in Switzerland, uh, where they no longer would even receive me with open hands because they were involved in a lot of crime. This particular company, not so much, but there was some Swiss companies, uh, major companies that were involved in Mount Everest, or at least Mont Blanc, of violent crime against me during MKUltra. Insultive, derogatory, uh, undermining, uh, in absolutely every aspect, disgusting, beyond disgusting. That's Switzerland. That's a real Switzerland. I will never, ever forget this stuff. And uh, it became evident, uh, also from Donald Trump's words, that he would, after all, not do the business with the Chinese, whatever. Uh, however, that he would use them for something on the watch, that it would be still Chinese. So, uh, the safest way... To say is that this is a Swiss Chinese watch. Um, the third beyond inside probably is made in China. This is just my guess. Uh, um, I don't know about those diamonds also. I'm not saying that they are not real. Um, it could be also some other stuff. Uh, it could be even as Donald Trump insisted he would use a Swiss company for a favor, for a small favor, that means, you see the stamp on the bottom, that says Swiss made. Um, Swiss do a lot of that dirty business. Swiss do get mechanisms from China and uh, on frequent basis on 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 to do list on on a daily life. They are using a Chinese industry to do nothing other than stamp their watches with a Swiss-made sign. That is actually happening. This stuff is uh, impossible to deny. However, not all the Swiss watchmakers do that. Swiss watch industry, however, did find itself in a tremendous collapse once China opened its door and welcomed uh, Japano japano swiss industry watch industry all the japanese and swiss manufacturers put not only their money into china but also technology for a much much cheaper more affordable costs with which they would afterwards supply including swiss and japanese markets therefore european and asian markets they flooded with much cheaper manufacturing costs uh, the watch world yeah, so there's no cursing that uh, Chinese do a really top technology. Uh, Hewlett Packard I'm using is made in China and yours probably too. Um, few components in today's world you would still found that are not made in China.
this is just the reality, the nature of this uh, industrial revolution. Um, I don't have anything else I would add to this watch. This is it. Peace, brothers. Uh, this is a review of the watch according to MK Ultra Brainwash. Now, that's precisely exactly on how things went. Uh, Donald Trump with the Melania Trump also insisted that the watch sales that he would do, it would be literally for me. Literally even insisted that his from his sales, for the sales of the watches, yeah, it would be money that he would use to give me the money for the from the watches. Um, you know, um, two days ago it was Zelensky that met with Donald Trump. And I came to the conclusion, or yesterday, or whatever, uh, I came to the conclusion that Zelensky did really, really... Um, at, at first I was confused, because it's this is stupid. I mean, the way Donald Trump uh, is just an individual is looking for attention. I mean, he is impotent enough to even refuse additional meetings with uh, Kamala Harris. Uh, but he is provocative. He's a provocateur. This individual is a provocateur. He's a, he's a bully. He's just a provocateur because he really doesn't have anything he would really tell. There is nothing new to tell about his agenda. Maybe that your neighbors are eating cats uh, and dogs that they get on your garden. Maybe something like this. But other than that, you're not going to learn nothing new from Donald Trump, really. He doesn't have much to tell, really, world about it. He is counting simply on somebody who is stupid enough to go fuck himself, uh, pay a hundred or whatever thousand or hundreds of dollars for something that's worth a whole a lot or less. Uh, and, uh, you know, consequently, as a result of it, um, he just... It's like buying a shit car, which... You know it's a shit, but it's too late for you to go buy another car because you just can't do that. It's too expensive for you, let's say, for your budget. And so now you're going to fucking like it, even if you don't like it. You know what I mean? Every time you're going you're gonna to sit in the car, you're going to like it because that's it. You don't have second choice. And I think this is how his voting base operates. I think that... I think the whole thing is a mental clusterfuck. Honestly, this is my opinion about Donald Trump's elections. This is how it is. Um, he locked a good, a decent number of his supporters. Um, strange people, anyhow, because all of you should be ashamed. I think I did deserve more attention to Donald Trump, but instead you were using my case to create the case for Donald Trump and well I don't regret that Donald Trump fucked you honestly all that um, stuff bad stuff you do bad stuff comes back to you and uh, it's nothing wrong with it as far as the watch I give you an estimate uh, on how much Donald Trump spent and the rest, we're going to find out because eventually will be people who will purchase this watch. And we're going to see what the watch really is. Uh, what the watch, what was in it in the watch, what exactly the watch was worth. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video. I don't have anything else to say. Uh, Donald Trump exploited me also for this watch. Donald Trump exploited Slovenian police destruction, annihilation. Sabotage, theft, vandalization of my personal items I purchased through AliExpress, also absolutely through eBay, and what became now lately even Temu. So um, he had hands in it, in this watch mental illness which British royals hoped for through the postal services. Uh, it would eventually develop into real mental illness. Uh, he is far from it, but he tried. Another one. 
another one bites the dust, Donald. That's you. 